Allegro sidestep, big kick down towards full forward, a one-out duel between Barker and Sidebottom. Bruce Monteith with a long kick towards full forward, Sidebottom a chance, Sidebottom from the back, taken under the boot, and the major for WA at the 16 minute mark in the second quarter again. He must kick it long and that's the way it goes, up towards a half forward line, Sidebottom! And Sidebottom had his name written all over that one. Over to Featherby, over the half forward line, there goes a the pass to Sidebottom! Great football, WA. He's already kicked, what, two? One. One. One, this could be second, or could it? The crowd says yes, the goal umpire says yes, and another goal on the board to WA, Lou Richards. This is his third match since coming down this season. Jelly in the goal square. And at the back side bottom of Greek mark. He looked to have little or no chance of taking that mark after Jess pushes him to the turf. Back towards that half back line, side bottom and Keenan. Oh, I think I'll pay side bottom for the mark. Keenan not too happy about it. Strong kick out to the wing, looking for side bottom. Back to Saru, half back flank for St Kilda. Side bottom, Fletcher behind. Side bottom with great mark. Oh, enormous mark. Fletcher tried to spoil, but he stripped at the crucial moment. And side bottom, handball away to Saru. Gee, St Kilda and Westwood grappling today. Side bottom, Saru, Ditwich, and Booth is on the sidelines. And here goes side bottom. He's playing a champion's game to Jean. Beautiful pass. Away he goes. Around the half back line. Side bottom coming in. Oh, he charges. He could be reported by Empire Delhi. So he's reached. He has been reported. Side bottom has been reported. Deliberate charge. Elbow signals umpire Della. Side bottom can't believe his luck. And the advantage free kick going up the Vanderhoe. Play goes on. Green for back pocket. Rather some killed the members wing. Side bottom and Scanlon. He's not a bad player this boy. Side bottom. Elliot knocks it away, Cunningham takes the ball and it's knocked away from him, good play by Gallagher, tackling's good stuff. It's Marsh and Sidebottom, they've got to whack on the mouth. The Bombers into attack, Sidebottom should mark this. Well, they're booing him for what he did, but his performance as a player is his BOG at the moment. Estimate fourth, as Robert Elliott drives that ball out to the wing. Side bottom again, particularly uh, side bottom giving Aston a lot of trouble as O'Day kicks that ball well back into general play and side bottom just taking his uh, oh, just taking his second smack in the mouth. Cunningham, short one to side bottom. Oh, well marked. De perusal. Side bottom. They're playing him everywhere to try and get a lift, St Kilda. Muir breaks away with the ball from the Bombers, not Scanlon rather, but side bottoms there. And uh, St Kilda's best player. We believe he was reported in the first quarter for striking Nagel. The kick to Didrich. Uh, achieved something, he found Barker who runs into an open goal. That's a net result, a goal for Smiley. Mackay's calling for this one. Side bottom. Superb mark. Lofts. Side bottom. <laughs> Absolute rubbish that. Side bottom, you had nothing. Well, he shouldn't have even... Uh, tried to provoke some sort of situation. I couldn't see a free kick there at all, personally, but the umpire didn't. Certainly we're much closer. Uh, he's much closer than us. But side bottom, the lip at the moment. Have a look at him, say, have a look, oh, I don't want to pick you. <laughs> Five for three and a half. I'm not going to waste my time on you. <laughs> and plucked in nicely by Satori, who's done well on his wing. He uh, th th kicks it towards side bottom, who should run straight through Jenkinson towards Young. This must be a goal for St Kilda. Drawn. Half distance kick. Side bottom meeting the ball. Oh, well played. Green for St Kilda. Good pick up and spin. Quarter time to replace Roberts. 
O'Keefe centers the ball, but Malthouse is there. Side bottom as well. Oh, how's that from Mark? Short pass to Day. Day, the topping the state recruit for the Bombers this year. There's side bottom. Oh, so easy. that's giving it away, isn't it? Well, he was in the right that time, side bottom, because he was tapped on the leg with the boot that time, Peter. He was in the hands of the trainers after that incident. He's got a bad knee, and he's at the centre-half forward position. Doesn't look too good to me, and this will be a big blow for St Gilda. They couldn't win this match now, but for the rest of the season, out of game. Punched away in defence. Finally, Barker to side bottom. The two big names from on the St Kilda forward line. Side bottom shot for goals, a goal. Down it goes towards the pocket and well played Thomas. St Kilda out playing Carlton at this stage. Thomas tries the short pass, side bottom's the target and beautifully done. Big bottom stuck out and arms well forward. In it's a very dull, dark day. As I mentioned, we have the lights on here at VFL Park. Duper has also been a good kick winner for St Kilda around Towns from the centre of the ground to side bottom can he handle the ball he does beautifully the big fellow straightens up and he's put it through that's his third goal he played it magnificently and then straight down the centre captain did reach the mark Saru punches away brilliantly past Calorie picked up nicely then driven downfield by Green side bottom magnificent juggling mark In. Barker oh what a have a lot more confidence in that league. Head towards full forward. Big Ross down there. Might beat the pack though. Ross, side bottom. Can he weave his way through? He has. It's a goal, okay. The target here. Hampshire comes in. Side bottom. Plenty of pace for a big fellow. McGee deals with him, but he breaks the tackle. Lines up and bangs a goal. And that's a magnificent individual effort by Gary Sidebottom. Morris Nates and Saru uh, 31, and this is Kelly the Road for St Kilda. Uh, quickly across towards side bottom, he's doing well on the forward line. Look at that spin for big man, that's great stuff. And he lines up and puts one of those powerful kicks of his and just kicked the goal. Saru with a good thump out of the pack. The pass count, he lost it. He goes side bottom after it. It's on the half forward line. Side bottom kicked two brilliant goals first term. Look at him go. Lines up and let's go with another one. His third goal. Barker playing on the back line, kicking in towards side bottom. Side bottoms, he's unbeatable. He's almost giving Captain a football lesson today. Pressure on him. At Moravan, St Kilda captain Gary Sidebottom was the centre of one of the ugliest incidents of the year. Oh, come off it. That is a, it was a, it was a fair bump. What do you think? Yeah, yeah, fair bump for mine. Well, I don't know about this 50 free kicks. Somebody's thrown a can out and hit side bottom on the head with a beer, beer can. That's lovely, that is. That is beautiful. Veterans like Jezza and the much vaunted Gary Sidebottom and youngsters like Dean Herbert enabled St Kilda to go into the last quarter with a six-point lead. Well, for mine he was through. Inboard. Madden. Got a free kick. Something's happened behind the play. Sidebottom was down, holding his head. Carmen. Oh, Carmen, you're in trouble. Twin centre wing and half forward, looks for side bottom, lovely pass, beautifully done by Barker.